Hello, YouTube, and welcome back into Certain Death, I think, <coughs> as I choke on myself. Um, yeah, we, we've got to get some kind of pressure down here. Let's, um, let's chop this. <coughs> let's try to distract him long enough to get some crossbows going on. Pardon me. My goodness. <laughs> With that attitude, I know, right? A terrible attitude. And a woefully terrible attitude. We do have some semblance of a military coming along, though. Cool. That's fine. <laughs> so lame. Oh, it hurts. Your city gets raised by a, a by by city states. Feels bad, man. Sweet Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. And these guys are f ugh. Good thing we can still attack there. Wait, do we have a general nearby? It's classic medieval. Sweet lord. Never did get this city walls. Don't think it'll matter at this point. My god. You know, there have been so many games of Civ that I've played like this that you just kind of like fly by the seat of your pants a little bit because um, you're you're trying to overcome deity and, and you're just economizing and doing all the things. And there are so many games where the AI should have done just this. And so the fact that it's actually happening now, I honestly like encourages me a bit. I actually think it's a good thing. <laughs> Poor dose. Okay. Stop it. Stop killing me. Look at their healing, too. It's so annoying. Like, the healing pr plus the crusade. Like, look at this. Holy Jesus.
Hmm. I have to kill him at some point. Yeah, I need Pike and Shot. I need a lot. I need to not have just gone towards River Valley, is really the, the truth of it. Oh, Arabia, you are now going to hold a special place in my heart. One, one, the, the one where I loathe people. That's this game. That's what this feels like. Alright, muskets next turn. Maybe we can hold this with a musket there. Holy, there's so many units. I've never been this overwhelmed mid-game before. It's kind of awesome. Man is a military animal. <laughs> yeah, too. Crusade as well. Crusade plus Mamlux, man. Arabia happened, my friends. Arabia. They're bullies. Let's bring that guy back. Okay. Go for metal casting. Our science is pretty good. So we're actually getting to these techs uh, fairly quickly. I want to buy tiles and finish St. Basil's so bad. So very bad. Rip the musket. <clears throat> I can't trade it again. <laughs> huh? 
No cheesiness for me. I was going to trade this away. Son of a... Oh, my goodness. This is overwhelming. She is on to me. Yeah, it could be that it's under siege. That that would make sense. She's I mean nobody nobody's around him. I don't think it's going to help. Muskets it is. So I could flip Carthage. But I don't get to they don't they're not my they're not mine. Oh my goodness. Feels real bad, man. Imagine todas as conquistas surpreendentes que as mentes brilhantes da minha nação realizarão. I have no idea where she is. I have no idea where anyone else is. Seems like Australia is coming from this direction, but that's all I know. We just don't have the damage output to, to counteract Crusade. Look at this. I just have to produce any unit that we can here. Pike and shots will help. build more legions and potentially upgrade them to muskets no I'd rather just build a crossbow this really sucks Yeah, exactly. Upgrade him with what money? Holy Jesus. 1,200 military strength. Wow, they straight up just murdered my musket. Yeah, 10 combat strength on top of the four. It's just so silly.
Don't finish nas nationalism? Why? Ooh. Industrial and modern. It's a good call, man. Good looking out. Tomb MVP. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, because I need to be running that. I actually need a policy switch probably in two turns. I need the uh, policy card for these pike and shots. Otherwise, we're done. Yeah, very good catch. Thanks, Tomb. See? This is why you guys should follow Tomb. He's great. Oh my god, really? <laughs> god damn it. God damn it. For every like one we kill, he's killing two of ours, maybe? First, Hephaestus makes a great and massive shield, and he forged on the shield two noble cities. Okay. It's starting to look like most of your games. Eh. That's fair. All right, that's enough knights. Probably. We'll let that one finish. Our money is dwindling. Let's go ahead and get that trader then. Pedro in the industrial era now, too. Like we have to go get Rur. That's not true. We don't have to. We have to survive. So many Mamluks. Doesn't help that he was like completely left alone. Like he doesn't have a neighbor. We are the neighbor. <laughs> both a tradition and the future. And we look with pride and confidence in both directions. Like full, full round of attacks on these Mamluks and we barely do half damage to it. Does anybody else really, like, get the feeling that they want to nuke Salad in this game? Because I am starting to feel that way. I 
should have killed Muscat. See, I don't like killing. I don't like killing city states that are actually useful. Like Muscat's actually quite useful, and we've been lacking gold for some time. So that's a that's a pretty painful kill. <laughs> no, we're living. This is living. It's just it's just not efficient. It's just it's just gonna look like a sloppy game, and that's okay. We might have to nuke folks, Wind Waker. Might have to. I didn't switch policies. I'm so stupid. Playing a little too sloppily. Just worried about this. <laughs> I want to hold Rome. Jesus. And the old Legion in a nuke rush. We already got that achievement. The clearing the contamination. Okay, so that kind of worked. Um... We're going to want to slow down ballistics by one turn to let this guy finish. Yeah, that doesn't matter. It's just crusade. It's going to be hard to jump two eras ahead of him, basically, uh, so that we can overcome his 14 extra combat strength. I already have iron. Definitely looking for a trade deal, though. That helps so much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh. Are we are we finally turning the tide on this a little? His military score has not gone down. Indonesia just saved themselves from future nuking, no doubt. No doubt about that. Jesus.
there any good reason not to convert Rome's religion? I mean, I don't have the means to. I guess we have Eastern Orthodoxy. I can't do Inquisitors. That's going to be the problem. Let's try to do it, though. It's a good suggestion. <clears throat> Okay, that is useful. Thank you. Hedonica, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Appreciate it. You die. Ballistics in three. The trick's going to be getting our cities back. followers from 5k oh yeah that's true that's fun that is fun <laughs> Alice unfollows hey come back Really? There we go. Yeah, this war may not end for a while, though. I'm gonna be pretty salty about this one. So he's he's biting off a a, a pretty big uh, a pretty big bite. I can be super vindictive. <laughs> Ransom, thanks for the follow as well. Welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. What was that? Forbidden City, there, that's fine. That much I can handle. Okay. Ah, 
All right, now that we have ourselves a, a middling, although if not proper, military, seems like we're going to make some headway back. Still need volley promotions to deal with all this crap, though. All right, let's just hope we get it. We'll probably get same turned on it now. Okay. Get out of my lands. Had a twisted design. Nice. Red on a green ground. Well, that's fun. Another all prickly angles. We need to plant some woods to make it uh, an the interesting St. Basil's. It was ornamented but. with scales of blue and crimson. I'll the take it all the same. Was in quarters like a melon. Let's get on our knees and pray. Sweet. I don't know to whom. Not the most impressive St. Basil's we've ever come up with, but uh, not too bad at the moment. And if we plant some more woods over here, it'll look pretty decent. Snow Petra hype indeed. Okay. Are you, uh. Oh, yeah, you did turn into a field cannon. That's actually okay. All right, we have to go get industrialization now. I need to get Rur. While we build this army to try to retake. Retake what is ours! Fifteen for those upgrades. Alrighty. Um. Should grow reasonably quickly now. All right. Let's hold a turn. No more crusade for you, Mr. Magoo. Let's go over there. Let's make him chase us. Chase me. It'll be fun. There we go. This is what we want to see. In a market economy, however, the individual has some possibility of escaping from the power of the state. Is he building as a wonder? What's he building? Where's this? No, he's probably... Yeah, he's building a commercial hub. There. Thanks, dude. What a guy. Sure knows what he's doing. All right, what do we want to keep building? Probably just like ranged units. Probably don't need cavalry really just to push these cities back. That that would be for later. So we probably still want this. And then we want to we want to run um feudal contract instead. And probably this we're fine on now.
That guy's probably dead, but that's all right. Just want to start sneaking down these units. No extra combat strength for you. Are all the governors good or some more useful than others? Some are way more useful than others. Like, way more useful than others. He's down to... Well, his military score really hasn't changed too much. Um, I can't elaborate. So, uh, in every single game, you're going to have Magnus. Uh, Magnus, his first, uh, his first promotion is just invaluable. Makes your chops better. You can chop, like, you can one-turn wonders. You can chop out settlers. You can do all kinds of stuff. So, in every single game, you're probably going to have Magnus Liang. There are, other ones are forgettable. Now, if you're playing multiplayer, it's a whole different thing. But on Deity, Victor is almost always useless. Uh, Moksha is only useful in a religious game. Uh, Reyna is often useful as can Amani be. Um, Pingala, I almost have every single game just because he gives you extra economy, and I like economy. Um, it kind of it kind of depends on what you're going for. Like if you're if you're doing a tourism game, sometimes Parks and Rec can be use use useful. Curator is super valuable in that game, but it just kind of depends on where you're going with it. Um, but in general, you're always going to have these three governors. So hopefully that helps. All right, so we've gotten rid of most of Islam, so he's not going to completely destroy us in our own territory now. Thanks, Tomb. See you later, buddy. Yeah, he's just grabbing uh, great people on us, which is annoying. <laughs> All the rerolls. All right, nine turns on the era, too. This is scary. We need uh, a lot of era score here. We need... At least nine for a normal age. Otherwise, our sweet, sweet loyalty stuff is going to fall apart. Wow, look. Even attacks. That's crazy. Where's your 10 combat strength now? Okay, um, we can start on Rur in five turns. We're going to get a great person. All right, so who's gone? Probably all the good ones, right? There's Newton. Yeah, uh, that's okay. Still going to take it. Just feels right. All right, let's hold. Hey, that's super nice. Industrialization and chemistry. Yeah, 
Yeah, not so easy anymore, is it? Peter got Big Ben. Oh, that's what converted there. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. How's the war going? It's okay. <laughs> We're surviving. Just barely. You're just barely surviving. Left. Yeah, so he doesn't want to give us our cities back, and that's just unacceptable. We already lo we already permanently lost one to the city state, which is super annoying. not have crusade over there. All right, so next turn we can start on Ruhr. Um, we do have a few chops left for it, thank God. But I'm not going to feel as confident about it. Boy, this game took a dive in the last, like, 15 turns. It's kind of fun though. It's 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 kind of it's kind of refreshing to like fight a a tough war in the middle of the game. I'm actually not that upset about it cuz I think it's interesting. Yeah, without crusade that though neither of those wars would have been anything. I should have done more to uh prevent the crusade from being as effective as it was. Definitely my bad. We leaped for the mechanical things. People need the use of their hands to feel creative. Okay. Found some coal, nice. All right, so which, which is this general? This is classic and medieval. So this guy is done, Zos. We are done with you. You, on the other hand, are medieval and renaissance. So you are applying to the muskets, but not the field cannons. Yeah, we still have to build a factory. Okie dokie. Um, now that we have that, let's go and get some cavalry and really make him regret his choices. 
and you do what? You are medieval renaissance as well, so you are affecting the muskets, but nothing else. Don't we have an industrial era one? Could have sworn that we did. There you go. And you can have this back. Six turns on the era. A common mistake that people make when trying to design something completely foolproof is to underestimate the ingenuity of complete fools. Ooh, he's got cores now. That's scary. Okay, three more air scores for regular age. Three more air scores. Let's see. All right, I think we can get nationalism now. Because what are we producing? A bombard, and that guy, and this guy. Yeah, that's fine. Let's get rid of this. Let's go science heavy now. And let's take as much money as we can. We can upgrade a few more units. Yeah, killing the core will get us some points. Absolutely. All right, get that crusade trash out of here. Tired of it. That city will soon have all the tiles with that much culture going on. Oh, there are you my No, you're the you're the you're the obsolete one. All right, Zimbabwe's gone. Starting to look like a better peace deal. Doesn't want to give me my cities back, though. Uh, do I plan to build entertainment complexes? I do not know. Human nature, as manifested in I don't think they're super good. Provides the momentum of the machinery of human evolution. bit of era score there. We can also core an army uh, to get era score. Or just core. Rather. Own two bombards. That happens in three turns. How do you handle happiness? Uh, usually don't need to pay too much attention to it, but in this particular game, we have a triple continent split. 
So while we have very sad cities right now, it's largely war weariness. Um, so once that goes away, we should have a, a fair amount of happiness again. Um, I might want to get another city back down there, although it's really late. Um, and then and then just policies typically tend to be how I solve it. Policies and governments. And golf courses. What's up, Knox? How you doing, bud? He's not wrong. Golf courses as well. Yep, TOA, Coliseum, things like that. Generally very, very helpful. Get that era score. TOA? Yeah, sorry. Temple of Artemis. Not worth my time. Enemy spy escaped. Neutralized Magnus. Wow. Such, such a dick move. So now we have 10 turns, 11 turns without Magnus, where we aren't building Rear Valley. That is not good. That is really not good. AI actually playing well. I feel about medics, I rarely use them. I don't necessarily think they're bad. I just don't really have an opinion. Because I really rarely use them. Although if I rarely use them, they're probably bad. <laughs> Funny how that works. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. There's there a score that we needed. Pillage our own farms. That's why we built them, of course. Famously. Okay. One of three cities recovered.
I should probably grab a money. That could have helped us a while ago too. Um, money to Muscat just so we don't have to fight him anymore. I know I've never seen the AI play this well either. That's why. Uh, that's why it was kind of surprising. All right, hashtag one more turn. Swear to God, if we miss Ruhr because of this, then I'm definitely nuking Arabia. He would deserve it. Okay. You can just build economy again, I think. Yeah, for now you can have that. It's eventually going to be a district, but so be it. Okay, industrialization uh, and military science. Weird going into like new eras like this. I so rarely flesh out the whole tree. And with that, with the onset of this turn, oh my god, stop it! Can we just take this city back, and we'll call it a call call it a video. Johnny got Oxford. We go into a normal era, and it feels more normal to me now that we have our cities back. <laughs> Two of three. Sorry, city. I don't even remember what your name was. You are the lost city. Uh, that's gonna that's gonna do it for a video. Holy turbulence, Batman! That 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 was a rocky ride. Um, but we are about to finish the factory. We once Magnus is back into Rome, uh, we can we've got plenty of harvest left. We have two stone, uh, rainforest, two rainforest, and three woods left to harvest for Rur. Uh, so that should be pretty good. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be all in the next video. Thank you for watching. If you're watching over on YouTube, don't forget to uh, you know like and subscribe. That that'd make me happy too. Thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next one.